Natasha Cloud, a pivotal player in the Washington Mystics championship run, has always had a strong connection with DC. However, when she became a free agent, Washington didn't extend an offer. On Thursday morning, Cloud made a half court shot at the Phoenix Mercury practice facility, striking a confident pose and strutting around. Her exuberance was clear as she declared it her day, much to the delight of her new teammates, including Diana Taurasi, the WNBA's all time leading scorer, who came over to congratulate her. Cloud, the Mystics' all time assist leader, joined the Mercury as a free agent this offseason. She was seen practicing alongside Christy Tolliver, a former Mystic and now an assistant coach. Cloud's happiness is evident as she transitions to her new team. She spent her first eight seasons with Washington, contributing to the 2019 WNBA championship and earning two all-defensive team selections. Despite ranking second on the Mystics' all-time minutes played list, Cloud has moved from the beltway to the desert, it's always nerve-wracking when you leave the only thing you've ever known, Cloud shared. But from the moment I arrived here, I felt valued and appreciated. The passion I play with was welcomed here. A beloved figure in DC, Cloud was actively involved in community initiatives, especially in Ward 8. Yet, during her free agency, the Mystics chose not to make an offer. While there are disagreements about her departure, it's clear that Cloud has found a new home. She signed a two-year contract worth $200,000 per season, according to her hoop stats, and is averaging 10.7 points, 7.3 assists, and 5.7 rebounds, career highs, the Mercury team, featuring stars like Tarasi, Brittany Griner, Kalia Copper, Sophie Cunningham, and Rebecca Allen, supports Cloud's belief in their championship potential. Recently, Cloud became the 10th player in WNBA history to record a points assists double-double in a regular season game against the Las Vegas Aces, Natasha has been incredible since joining us, Mercury general manager Nick Uren stated. She is one of the best point guards in the league, playing both ends of the floor with great force and pace. She's everything we wanted. Uren highlighted Cloud's defensive intelligence as an often overlooked aspect of her game. Heading into Thursday's game against the Mystics, Cloud admitted to feeling a higher level of emotion, likening her departure to being fired. Grateful for her journey from St. Joseph's College to the WNBA, Cloud feels her relationship with the Mystics soured over time. Now, she plays with a renewed sense of purpose and a chip on her shoulder, Mystics general manager Mike Tebow explained that once Cloud expressed her desire to test free agency, they decided to let things play out, ultimately believing that parting ways was best for all parties involved.